Hey guys, this is Mark Russell with another episode of, I don't even have a name for this yet, but I wanna show you something really cool that I was just out here today at a client's house, how not to kill your trees with uh, herbicide. So specifically speaking, we have this cherry tree and a lot of times people will take their herbicide. Uh, for example, over here, when you have a mulch island, you know, like a little island at the base of your trees and all of a sudden your tree dies out and you're like, what the heck just happened? Here is something that you really want to pay attention to when you're using the herbicide. So check this out. This is what we're talking about. And this is a great example because it's two different things all in one example. So first example is never spray herbicide on exposed roots or for that matter roots anyway. Because, um, uh, you know, some herbicides, if they're little fissures or whatnot, it can get down into the bark, into the tree system, and boom, your tree is dead. Now, secondly, look at this. So the mode of action on herbicide is through the, I think it's called the lenticels or the stomata. Anyway, the leaf pulls down the herbicide and it enters into the tree system through the leaves. So, you know, you spray it on a weed and off it goes and it's done. Um, generally speaking, that's okay for a tree, but look here, right here, we've got this little thing. You might think it's a leaf. Oh, let's get rid of that weed. Let's get rid of that weed. And then all of a sudden you're calling your arborist saying, what the heck just happened? Why is my tree dead? Look at this, this is a great example right here. And right here, this tree, and also just as a side note, the reason that thing is sprouting out those water sprouts is because probably the lawnmowers hit the root, the cambium layer is a little bit irritated, and it's saying, oh, send out some water sprouts, just like kind of when you do a pruning cut, and it shoots out little water sprouts off the pruning cut. So that's the point. Be very, very careful when you're using herbicide at the base of a tree. And one last side note, look at this, this tree. We get a lot of calls about the grass not doing well. This tree right here, look at, see how it's like the grass is doing bad? Just mulch it, just mulch the base. The tree likes the O layer, the organic layer. The tree is gonna like thrive. Its root systems are gonna flourish as the mulch breaks down, holds in moisture, just about, oh, and you can go to About Trees and order a load of free wood chips, but that's another, for another video. So that's it. Be very, very careful with your herbicide. If you live in Atlanta and have any questions about your trees, feel free to give me a call. My name is Mark Russell. Been serving the Atlanta area since 1997. ISA certified arborist and track qualified. 770 Arborist is the number. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Take care. Bye-bye.